Sometimes, you know. <laughs> this is so much work. I'll put that here. Sorry. Oh my god, what are words? Other people might think differently, who cares? <laughs> over to Instagram and I asked you guys to choose one out of three videos. Testing beauty hacks, following a different YouTuber's tutorials, or a drunk wig tutorial. And guess which one you guys chose. I have never talked about drinking online or anything like that because first off, it's not like necessary to. Just a little PSA, I am 22, almost 23 years old, so this is, it's not like it's underage. I don't have like a, the biggest following ever of kids under 18, but if this is not the type of video that your parents would want you to watch, then do not watch this video. I do not want you getting in trouble. I want you to continue being able to watch my videos. It means a lot to me to be like a good role model um, for younger kids, and I don't think me drinking reflects on me being a bad role model because I am not promoting underage drinking by me who is legally able to drink to be drinking and then post a video after I have done so. Just saying, just saying, I'm an adult. If anyone has a problem with that, I'm sorry. I think this video will be funny. I wanted to do this. So here we are, I'm doing it and yeah. I'm gonna go make some mimosas and I will be back in a gif. Two hours later. Okay. 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 Oh. <laughs> I forget, I literally forget that the sun goes down so early now. It's three o'clock and I'm thinking, sun's going down, what am I doing with my life? I mean, not because the sun's going down, but like, side note, what am I doing with my life? After consuming four mimosas, four mimosas, that's like champagne, you know, cause like I'm a classy girl. I just don't wanna look naked, that's all I'm worried about. Hi guys, hi, this is me, Hannah, and um, today we are doing a wig, trying on tutorial no well today we're today we're tr today i'm going to show you guys how to wear a wig starting from the top you take you take the wig out of the bag i remember the first time i was like i'll put that here today we're going to put on a wig cap. Oh my god, what am I doing today? You just gotta make sure all your hair is tuckerooed in there. If you have more hair than me, which is more likely, you take your longer hair and you can either tuck, 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 or if you have longer hair, what you gotta do is like a little ponytail and then you braid it. So you braid your hair and then you just like pin it all around your head and you make a little swirly do. Like it looks like a little like cinnamon roll and you make it like as flat as possible because like girl if you see a wig and you see someone wearing a wig and they look like the peanut like persons from the from the Proud Family movie, you know what I'm talking about. No, only the best people in the world will not point that out to you unless you're a very close friend. If you're a very close friend then you can be like girl. Your head looking like the peanut head people. But like, if you ain't a close friend, don't do that. That hurts people's feelings. I like to guess and uh, assume my head is very small. Assume it is. Other people might think differently, who cares? If you guys aren't keeping up, it's totally fine. I don't, I'm not keeping up myself. Ooh, I am genuinely actually usually really bad at like teaching people things. I don't know why. Wait, I do know why. Also, side note, guys, I just wanna say thank you so much. We just hit 400,000 subscribers. That's crazy. I like don't even believe that. I think it's fake. You guys have 800,000 eyeballs. There is so much going on right now. You have your wig and you put it on. This is from the beginning. Cut the lace, you do a rough cut of the lace and you're like, yeah, that's what my head looks like. But like it doesn't. No one's hairline looks like this. Look, that's a no bueno, that's a no go. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get my scissors that I did not prepare to already be here cause I, I don't know why I didn't prepare to, for that to be here. So you look at the wig line and you're like, that's not it cause my hair actually goes back there. Guys, this might be terrible, but like as long as you get the idea, that's all that matters. Take my words and make them better words. Really try not to cut your actual hair because I've done it before. And though it is funny, it doesn't feel good. So we're cutting the wig and I'm like, ooh, I'm gonna cut it way back here because that's where it goes. And then you cut down and I'm like, ooh, yeah, that goes down there. So we're gonna cut it down there. I actually get really sad when I cut wigs because I'm like, oh, someone tried so much harder 
to put all this extra hair on there and here I am cutting it off. Do, 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 do. Oh. Now you're like, gosh, now that I have this gorgeous wig on my head, how do I keep it on all day? Well, my friend, there are two options. Are you having a pretty chill, mild day? If you answered yes, then your best bet is to go with the got to bleed you glued gel. Do as much as you want, my friend. You do you. Honestly, you are great. So you take your blow dryer, and then you are going to make it like kind of dry, but not dry. I would also like to point out real quick that I did, in fact, throw out the majority of my hair things. From the video where I said I was throwing away all my hair products, I did. Except then I realized after throwing away my blow dryer that I was gonna need my blow dryer and the glue. This was in the trash, not in the trash. Anyways, let's keep going. It's three o'clock on a Monday. Now you're gonna put the wig in place. Press it down. Oop, that's my hair. Oop. Wait, I forgot to cut to cut around my ears. Sometimes, you know. Oh. Champagne and pools. Uh, why is this not working? Oh, oh, she's good. So now you're gonna take your little flappy flap that you made and you're gonna press it right down. Ah! Ooh, yes. Now, what you gotta do, you gotta make sure that the all around, that this part, I'm just gonna like make it look a little more natural by like cutting little pieces to make them like a little shorter. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm doing it. Great. The next thing I personally would do, what I was make, I would, oh my God, what are words? What I'm going to do is I'm going to put my foundation on a little like angled brush, like a brush that's like a little thinner. You're gonna go over the part. Deal, deal. Oh yes. So from up close, it might be kind of shitty, but like at least from far away, now it's like, ooh, that girl knows what's up. Perfect. Now, I guess the final thing to do is to make sure it's like whatever style you want to wear. This is so much work. Sorry. This way, oh, I'm gonna put some clips in this. Uh, got my bobby pins. Oh my God, look at it. Let's keep going, let's do that again. Oh yeah, oh we did that. The wig is pulled back, it has the things. We just are like slaying the game, yeah? Aren't we? Take it from me, everything looks better from far away, so don't walk up to anyone if you did it wrong. Guys, the glue with this wig, oh my God. The wig is good, everything looks fantastic. I hope you guys learned something from this video today. If you didn't, I am sorry. Uh, it's probably my fault. So this is that, and that's this. I feel great. Oh my god, oops. Now that we look like a princess, what are we gonna do now? Ooh. Anyways, you guys can wear wigs if you want. You cannot wear wigs if you don't want. I don't know, I don't care. I'm in full support of you guys doing anything you wanna do in your life. I'm so glad that I got to drink and hang out with you guys. I'm gonna take this wig off now. If I ever do meet and greets, like, let's do it in a restaurant, you know? That'd be so fun. Oh, oh my God, ew. Oh my God, why do I look so gross? Okay, this is a situation, it's fine. Anyways, I'm just gonna go like this the rest of the video. Matter of fact, I have this hoodie sweatshirt that I could wear right now. What a nice crop top. This is one of my favorite crop tops ever because it shows clouds and a wig being flown. How cool is that? That's really fun, right? Yeah, I can't remember where I got this. Actually, wait, I do remember where I got this sweatshirt. I got it at hannahforcier.merchlabs.com. It comes in cropped and it comes in long and it comes in t-shirt form. <laughs> you don't have to get it if you don't want to, but I mean, it's funny if you do because, you know, it's like a wig flying in the sky. I think that's really funny. If you are new to my channel, please click the subscribe button if you want to. If you are, um, you know, already subscribed, then I already love you so much. If you want to share this to your friends, if you want to tweet this out, and you can if you want to. Why did I start singing that? I don't know. Anyways, thank you so much for almost a half a million subscribers. You guys, we are 100,000 away, which sounds like a lot, but it's not because it only took one year for me to hit 
400,000, which is crazy. Wow. You guys are so cool. Oh my god. I am the luckiest person in the world. How did I get here? Oh my god. You guys are so amazing. Oh my god. Oh my god. As you guys know, I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you, so I want to thank you so much for the life that you've given me, and you guys are so amazing, and I love you so much. Thank you so much for watching this video, and thank you so much for, you know, watching, um, for subscribing to me on Instagram, and, you know, helping me out and helping me choose my video ideas. If you guys want me to make another one of these videos, go ahead, comment down below. And I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys next time. Also, shout out to my friend Caitlin who does drunk makeup tutorials. That was actually a factor into me choosing to even do this video today because, you know, she's amazing. And, oh my god, I want to do one with her. Oh my god.